Hi everyone, in this tutorial I will uh, explain you how to add using a sorban. So uh, to be sure you will uh, understand the addition using the sorban, I will show you four examples. So we begin with a very easy uh, example. We would like to add 12 plus 5. So to add these numbers, we write the first number on the sorban. The first number is 12. We write 12. And uh, to add 5, we add uh, five coins in the unit column, so five coins is here, and we have the result uh, 12 plus 5 is equal to 17. So, uh, the second example, we would like to add 134 plus 97. So, like we, like, uh, we, di we did in the last example, uh, we write the first number on the Sorban, so the first number is 134 and we would like to add 97 so to add 97 firstly we add 90 and secondly we add 7 so to add uh, 90 we would like to add 9 coins in the in this column but we cannot because it only writes uh, 6 coins so 90 is equal to 10 uh, is equal to 100 uh, minus 10. So to add 90, we add 100 and we remove uh, 10. And uh, we added 90. And uh, after we would like to add 7. And we cannot once more add 7 because it only writes 5 in the unit column. So 7 is equal to 10 minus 3. So to add 7, we add 10 and we remove 3 and we have the result uh, 134 plus 97 is equal to 231 so the third uh, example a little bit harder uh, we would like to add 2098 plus 3243 so we write the first number on the solvent the first number is 2098 and we would like to add 300 a uh, 3000 sorry 243 so we to add four uh, 3000 we cannot add 3 here so we add 5 thousands and we remove 2000 and we added 3000 after we would like to add 200 so we put two coins here and uh, we added 200 and now we would like to add 40 and once more we cannot uh, add 40 because it doesn't rest any coin in the tens uh, column so 40 is also equal to 100 minus 60 so we add one 100 and we remove 60 and we added 40 and finally we would like to add 3 so we cannot because it only rests one coin so to add three uh, three is equal to 10 minus 7 so we add 10 and we remove 7 and we have the, the result so uh, it's equal to 5341 the last example uh, with three numbers now so we would like to add 5679 plus 406 plus uh, 12,708 uh, so we write the first number on the sorban so 5,679 and we would like to add uh, 406 so we would like to add 400 but we cannot because it only rests uh, 300 in the hundreds column so 400 is is also equal to uh, uh, 1000 minus 600 so we add uh, 1000 and we remove 600 and we added 400 and uh, after we would like to add 6 so we cannot add 6 in the unit column because uh, it doesn't rest any coin in the unit column so 6 is also equal to 10 minus 4 
So we add 10 and we remove 4. And uh, finally, we would like to add 12,718. Uh, uh, so to add this number, we add one coin in the tenth uh, thousands column. We add uh, two coins in the thousands column. We add seven coins in the hundreds column. And we add one coin in the tenth column. So here we added uh, 12,710. And we would like to add eight. So here we cannot add eight because it only rests four coins. So eight is equal to 10 minus two. So we would like to add 10 here, but we cannot because it doesn't rest any coin. So uh, eight is equal to 10 minus two, but it's also equal to 100 minus uh, 92. So to add eight here, we add 100 and we remove uh, 92. So we remove all the coins here to remove 90 and we remove 2. So we remove 5 and we add 3. And we have the sum of uh, the three numbers addition. It's equal to 18, uh, 803. So uh, I hope uh, uh, this video, this video uh, helped you to understand uh, how to add you using a sorban and I hope uh, you liked it. Uh, I uh, would like to say uh, thank you and uh, goodbye.